The Mobile World Congress is very important for the Graphene flagship because the flagship wants to reach out to companies to show what Graphene can do. Graphene has a lot of opportunities for uh, mobile applications, both in terms of low power consumption, in terms of broadband operation, in terms of flexibility, in terms of energy uh, uh, supply uh, for the devices. Graphene and 2D materials, they are like uh, inherently 2D di two dimensional, which means that they have mostly surface and no bulk. So everything that is happening in, in the close proximity, it will affect all the properties of the material, not only the surface. Graphene and 2D semiconductors, they have really uh, a really strong electrical response to everything that is happening, or the fields and charges and impurities. So this is kind of a building material for good sensors. We have realized in our lab's first samples of transceivers capable to reach high bitrate transmission, and we aim to design new basic components to do that, that we have the intention to present and to show at the Mobile World Congress. Uh, the aim is to get in touch with people and getting feedback from them on what they see directly and what they touch and see. And it will be a very exciting experience given that. This year there will be more companies. Um, we have also some more mature technologies to present. For example, there will even be a car that contains graphene and a drone that contains graphene wings. Also, we will have some more advanced demos for data communications, for example, to show ultra-fast transmission of data between two video streams, and also some of the other prototypes will be presented in a more mature fashion.